Hi guys, Christy here. Today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys my March 2018 boxy charm. I'm so excited to film this one because I'm actually going to do like a try on style for this box. So I will be trying on all the products that I got in this month's box. If you guys are interested on what I received, then go ahead and keep on watching. Also, don't forget to check out the description box below for more information on the products or the overall price of the box as well as my like link to sign up with BoxyCharm. So let's just go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I pulled out of my box is this South Main Beauty Under Eye Gels and this goes for $10. And it comes with three of them so this is what it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. So I guess you guys should be careful when you open this because it's super like slimy. Alright, let's do this. Too close to my eye. They're super slimy. Ugh. Okay. Okay, I think I put it on there. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and leave this on for 30 minutes and I will be right back. Alright guys, so it's been 30 minutes, so I'm just going to go ahead and remove these. Oh, that feels so weird. Alright, so the end results, I feel like it does not reduce dark circles, but I feel like I probably have to use like all three in order for me to see a result. But um, I didn't really have puffiness under, so I can't really tell you about that. And I do feel moisturized and refreshed. I do feel like I look a little bit more awake than I did 30 minutes ago. So that's good. And I don't know, it was kind of fun. Um, it did kind of sting under my eyes like a tiny bit. Like I was just kind of like weirded out by that, but... um. I don't know, maybe that's just how it works or anything. Anyway, we're just going to go ahead and move on. Alright, so the next product I received is a product by Pretty Vulgar. And this is their Make Them Blush brush, which looks like this. I just love the packaging. It is so cute. It looks like a little picture frame. And the shade that I got is 18 Hush Blush. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what it looks like. I had already swatched it, but I'm just going to go ahead and swatch it again so that you guys know how pigmented it is. Sorry, my camera just like died on me. So this is two swatches and this is just one. So that you guys can see. It's really, really blendable. And I just think it's such a like a subtle, like, dusty rose. Um, This is what it looks like inside the packaging. It is just so, so pretty. So I just went ahead and did uh, my foundation and concealer just so that I can try this on for you guys on camera. So um, I'm just going to kind of... Oh, by the way, it has like... I think it has a lot of fallout as you guys can see. Like, like that. Like, look. Like, it is just so much. So I think a little bit... Oh my god. This is like... This is a mess. Look at this. Can you see that? This is, this is a mess. I really recommend that you guys put your brush onto the product like very lightly or else you're going to make a mess and just, you know, kind of dust it off. And I do think that a little bit does go a long way. So it says that the Make Them Blush Powder awakens your complexion. Provides a natural glowy flush to your cheeks. It's a silky smooth formula that is long wearing and highly pigmented. And I do agree. I think it's super pigmented. Pigmented. That I think that you guys just need to like put your brush in it for like a little bit and then tap it out because it does have a lot of fallout. I have been using this blush a lot and I do think that it lasts for a long time. Um, it's my favorite to go. I really like the shade of it. Um, like I said, I swatched it for you guys so that you guys can see it much better on my arm. It's a super cute like a pink kind of peachy shade and I really do like it a lot. The next product I received in my box is the Vintage Cosmetics Company Smoky Eye Makeup Brush Set which looks like this and it came in a super cute box like this. Um, it's really really cute. I love the packaging and I like the color of the brushes as well. They're super super cute. I don't know if you guys can like read it but it says it says step one for the money, step two for the shadow, and then in step three it says go girl go. So I think that this is super super cute. Oh my god, I can't like freaking hold this. 
So that's what it looks like and they are super cute. So I'm actually going to be using this with another product that I received in this month's box, which is an eyeshadow palette. So the eyeshadow palette that I received was by Pure Cosmetics and I think it's a, like a collaboration with BoxyCharm and Pure Cosmetics, I believe. This is what the packaging looks like. By the way, I'm not sure that I said how much the these brushes were. Uh, these brushes are $23.15 as well as the eyeshadow palette is $36.00. So the eyeshadow palette is super, super cute. This month's theme was vacation, so I think that the eyeshadow palette like went super perfectly with it. This is what it looks like. These four shades down here are like calling my name. Like This whole section, four and two, it's so, so pretty. I like them. I can't wait to use them. So I'm going to go ahead and apply these onto my eyes as well as use the brushes that I received. I'm just going to go ahead and like swatch a few for you guys. Oh my god, this is so pigmented. They're so pretty, oh my gosh. Again, I'm going to start with Perfect and apply this all over my eyelid with the Step 1 brush. So this shade is basically just like a pale nude. And I would usually use this shade, um to set my eyeshadow primer but I didn't really want to use eyeshadow primer just so that you guys can see the natural colors of the palette and see how pigmented they are and like blendable they are so for my crease I kind of want to use Nakey and Duet together but first I'm going to apply Nakey and then I'll go lightly apply on Duet afterwards so this is Nakey it's super super pretty it's like a, a bright orange and oh my god, these are like so pigmented. I love Pure Cosmetics. I love all their like eyeshadow palettes that I've received from BoxyCharm. They're all super pigmented and they blend so well. Oh wow, these brushes are like super, super soft too. Oh my god, I love these. Usually, um, I feel like sometimes uh, eyeshadow brushes like poke my eyelids so hard. Like they don't have like a soft tip. But these, oh my god, these are like the softest brushes. Oh my god, these are like the softest brushes that I've ever used on my eyelids. Oh my god. Like, I can fall asleep just doing this. Next, I'm going to dip my br the same brush into Duet right here. Just like a little bit, just because I wanted to define my eyelids. So like right there. Oh my god, this thing is so pigmented. Look how blendable it is. Oh my gosh. It's so easy with these brushes too. They're so soft and I think that they're helping out a lot. So I'm just going to go ahead and clean it up real quick before I move on to my bottom lash line. For my lower lash line, I'm actually going to use Nakey and Do It It together. The last thing that I'm going to do is add Charmer all over my eyelid, which is this shade right over here. And I'm just going to go ahead and pack it all on my eyelids. Oh, it looks more like a glitter. Let me go ahead and use my fingers. There you go. This super pigmented. I really like this eye look. I think it's so subtle and pretty. I love all the shades. Alright guys, last but not least, I have this Double Decker Lashes Mascara. By butter bronzer and oh my god guys like this packaging it's like so freaking big and fat I, I just love it I love it the price of this is $20 and it gets 200% thicker lashes in just one quote and 314% increases in lash curl so the interlocking nylon fiber brush grasps each individual lash 
to lengthen, curl, and multiply the lashes from the root to the tip. So let's go ahead and test this out if this is the truth. I'm just going to go ahead and curl my eyelashes like normal. Boom. And I'm going to go ahead and put it on one side so that you guys can see the difference with my regular lashes. So I'll go ahead and do it on my right side. Can you guys see? Okay, that's a good spot. Hmm. Whoa, I do kind of feel like every eyelash is getting a cool. Like, well, look at that. Oh my gosh. I do think that it lets it pop out a lot more compared to my other mascaras that I normally use every day. So it, I feel like it makes it look blacker and longer. Um, it just looks really, really pretty as you guys can tell. Like, look at that. Like, When I was applying it, it kind of looked a lot clumpier. But now that I'm looking at it, it does look natural and pretty. It doesn't look super dramatic either. Oh my god, it is so pretty. I really like this mascara. It almost looks like I'm wearing eyeliner, but I'm not. It just really looks like my lashes are thicker. They're so pretty. Here's a little close-up so that you guys can see it better. Um, it looks so, so pretty. As you guys can see, they look really, really long. And this, I did not, I never curl my bottom lashes, but it almost does look curled under as well. So I really like this. I love the packaging, and I love how well it worked. I really like this a lot. It's so cool. Hmm. Double decker lashes. Alright guys, so that is the end of this video. I really hope that you all liked it. Don't forget to share it and also give it a thumbs up. I was trying to figure out what products were my favorite in this month's box. But honestly, these are like my favorite products out of the whole box. Which is like the entire box. And the only thing that's missing are these gels. But I mean, they're just okay. I just really like all of these. Like... These were extremely soft, this palette is super pigmented, this blush is super pigmented and I'm just in love with the color. And this, I really like this. I love how my lashes look super, super thick. So I really like this box. I give it a huge thumbs up. I like it so much, like I can't get over it. <laughs> so that is it for this try on video. I hope that you had fun watching this as much as I had fun like trying out these products and letting you guys know what I liked about them. Uh, if you guys haven't already, please subscribe to me and give this video a thumbs up. Also, share it if you like it. Um, and I will see you all next time. Bye.